hello and welcome to how to bake asset changes so you may find the occasion where you bring in an asset from the marketplace or from Quixel bridge and you find there's an issue with its orientation its scaling whatever it may be well what you can do uh, is go ahead and add an asset so i'm gonna go to Quixel bridge and we're gonna bring in bring in the uh, stairs here we're gonna add the stairs to my project and there we are and what i want to do is i want to bring these in and i want to change their orientation okay now normally one way you could do this if you're using your own assets is you could go into edit the mesh of this go to its import settings down in here and change ooh, change the transform of it and then click re-import however with things downloaded from the marketplace it makes it a bit trickier because when you click re-import it asks you to find the file which isn't as easy as you may think because it'll be hidden away down in your files and right not meant to find so an easy solution to this problem is that we can actually affect this ourselves directly inside the editor so with the object selected we're going to go to select mode up top and change it to modeling so now we're in the modeling mode we can then rotate this around however we want so i'm going to rotate it down this way it's 90 degrees this way and you can see the change here at 0, 0, 090 or minus 90 and in our shapes folder down here, well not shapes, I'm just sort of pad it down the side here. We're going to go down to find the bake setting. And there it is, bake, rotation and scale into mesh, mesh asset. So we click this button. You want to bake the rotation and we're going to bake the scale. And we're going to click accept. And now you can see the rotation of this is now fixed to 0, 0, 0. So now this is the default rotation for this particular object. And this also works for scaling as well. So let's say head. I go ahead and, and we scale this one to be a bit bigger and you can see scale is now 222 um, rather than go ahead and rescale every object and things like that I can just go into here click bake and we're going to do bake full scale accept and this should now say 111 okay so that's now the default size for this and we can see that if I drag it into the scene that is the default size for our mesh so there you go, quite a useful tool to fix little problems you may find with assets you get from either Quixel Bridge or the Marketplace. Uh, make sure you do check it out. There's loads of little cool things you can find in the modeling mode. So do check it out and experiment to find out more. Thanks for watching. If you like this video and want to see more of my videos, head up to patreon.com forward slash Ryan Laley, where all your donations really help me out and make the channel better. Thank you so much to all my patrons and YouTube members for the continued support. And I'll see you all next time. Bye everyone.